Hello, Achu. Let's read the question. The question says here, radiation coming from transition uh, N is equal to 2 to N is equal to 1 of hydrogen atoms fall on He plus ions in N is equal to 1 and N equals to 2 states. So, the uh, possible transition of helium ions as they absorb energy from the radiation is how much? Let's find out. So, the energy released by the helium at atom can be found by taking the product of the energy of the first orbit of the hydrogen atom. So, the square of the atom, uh, atomic number and the difference between the reciprocal of the square of the number of cells. So, first of all, find out the energy released due to the hydrogen atom and then compare it with that of the helium atom. So, this will help you in us answering in the this question. Okay. So, the energy released during the transition uh, from N uh, is equals to 2 to n is equals to 1 uh, of the hydrogen atom the energy released can be written as written as an equation e is equals to 13.6 z square into 1 by n1 square minus 1 by n2 square okay so as for the equation for the hydrogen atom z is equals to 1 n1 n1 is equals to 1 n2 is equals to 2 to substitute this uh, in in the equation will give e is equals to 13.6 into 1 into 1 by 1 square minus 1 by 2 square is equals to 13.6 into 3 by 4 ev okay so now uh, we have to compare this value with the energy released on each of the trans transitions mentioned in the question. The one with the value equivalent to that of a hydrogen atom will be the answer for the question. So as we all know, the atomic number of this ion will be Z is equals to 2. The energy released due to helium ion in the helium atom in the first case will be N is equals to 1 to n is equals to 4 1 2 you know, button n is equals to 4 so using this value in this in the question will give e is equals to 13.6 into 2 square into 1 by 1 1 square minus 1 by 4 square that will be 13.6 into 15 by 4 ev so this is not equal to that of the hydrogen atom therefore this is not the right answer okay in second case n is equals to 2 to n is equals to 4 okay so uh, the energy released will be e is equals to 13.6 into 2 square into 1 by 2 square minus 1 by 4 square that will be 13.6 into 3 by 4 ev Okay, this will be possible to be the answer. Let us uh, have all other options too. In third case, n is equals to 2, 2, n is equals to 5. So the energy released will be E is equals to 13.6 into 2 square into 1 by 2 square minus 1 by 5 square. Okay. That will be 13.6 into 21 by 25 ev okay and for the fourth case n is equals to 2 to n is equals to 3 the energy released will be e is equals to 13.6 into 2 square into 1 by 2 square minus 1 by 3 square that will be 13.6 into 5 by 9 ev Therefore, energy needed for transition of helium atom for n is equals to 2, n is equals to 2, 2, n is equals to 4 matches exactly with energy released for uh, H for hydrogen for n is equals to 2, 2, n is equals to 1. So, option D is the correct answer n is equals to 2 to n is equals to 4. Okay. Thank you.